Hi everybody, welcome to another edition of James Jam. I'm Jane, this is my jam. Um, clothes might look the same, I'm filming a few videos at a time just to get them up because I wanted to have a few ready and just decided to do them all at once here. So um, what I was just gonna do now is just a fun haul of some luxury stuff I got, some not so luxury stuff, um, but just to kind of show you some fun stuff. Um, I'll start out with one of my recent purchases is on my head, which is why I had it there. Um, it's a new play, a new pair of Quay sunglasses. They're a little fingerprinty, but I had been buying Ray-Bans and everybody had been talking about these Quay glasses. So I decided to try them out and, um, I have them. They have really good UV protection. Uh, they're polarized. They're called the Polarized Le uh, Legacy 126. Don't know if that means anything, but I absolutely love these. They are, um, really, I'm like putting my hair back too with them. Um, they are, just feel really comfortable. They protect your eyes. Um, they're sturdy, they're substantial, and they're about half the price of Ray-Bans, so I am a big fan. Um, the next thing I have to show you is these docks. These are from a heart line. You can see those are actually little hearts, and there's pebbled leather. Um, this, I, I'm going to blame this on um, Styled by Gwenny, because she showed a picture of these in white. Um, white with the black hearts um, on Instagram and it said should I get them and oh my gosh I fell in love with these shoes and so I had to look I had to try to find them I went um, on a couple websites could not find them at all and then before I found the white ones I spied these with this like bright pink purple fuchsia goodness and oh my gosh I love color so I was sold so these are my new docks. They have a nice um, non-slip sole. I, I love docks. I can't say enough good things about these shoes. They are comfortable. They feel good. They're substantial. They're sturdy. This leather out, outside is beautiful. The pebbled leather, I've never seen that before. Um, I have two, three, four other pairs of docks and a pair of docks white boots. I can't say enough about docks. Worth what you pay for them. They are phenomenal shoes. So I got those. Um, another new thing that I have gotten recently, which you've probably seen now in a few videos, is my third Celine Nano, um, luggage piece. Absolutely adore this. It's orange with an orange strip, uh, suede orange interior, um, and yeah, I just, I love this. I'll have to get a, some more organizer for it, but I, I am just, this is my favorite bag, I think, out of, um, like in general bags for a pretty affordable price, super good quality. Um, love the craftsmanship. Um, love the, uh, you know, attention to detail. Love the, uh, silver hardware on some of these. Just absolutely, absolutely adore these bags. So I got that. Um, I got another pair of shoes and you're going to be able to tell I love color so many ways because I got a pair of Uggs. These are not a pair of Ugg normal boots like you see a lot of people get. These are purple suede like winter boots. No black or tan or anything like that for me. I need color. When I saw these purple, yeah baby, these were coming home with me. I, I, I couldn't deny them. I haven't worn them yet, but they look super comfortable. Um, I know Uggs are good. I have some Uggs um, slippers. This has like a furry, oh, if I can get this out here. I'll kind of just try to show you here. The inside's like furry lined, like Sherpa lined, all Sherpa goodness in there. So yeah, I saw these, couldn't deny them. They are a new pair of winter boots for me. Um, then i uh, go with another bag. I gotta still take my tag off of, but I had gotten the Gucci Marmont. Um, you know, I don't actually know the name of this one. I don't know the name of a lot of my bags, but this is just beautiful, um, like velvet um, color. The, the color got me, it, it just did. I did not want one of the other um, bags that had the heart on the back. So, but this GG, I'm all cool with that. This opens up again to the beautiful pink lining in here with one little slip pocket and then it's all an open space 
So I have this. I have to take my tag off it yet and use it, but oh my gosh, another new thing that I love. And then I got some more Samorga organizers. Um, I was just going to show you quick. Um, just um, this one I got to go in my Dior, and we're going to um, try that on together. This actually, I paid a dollar extra to have a lipstick um, spot put in there. So you can see they attach it right up there. They do that for you. And then I, it has one big slip pocket here and two small slip pockets here. This is the closest color I could get to my bag um, without it. Uh, I didn't want it to clash, so I got this for it. Then I got another, um, another, uh, let me take some of this stuff out of here quick. Um, I got another tote for my second Celine Nano, and I paid for the lipstick um, container in this one too. Again, they're just a dollar more, and you can see it right back up here. You can put your uh, lipstick in there, just the one little holder there. So I got this for one of my, my second Celine Nano, and it's got the slip pocket and big slip pocket here too from Samorga in this beautiful green. And then um, this and this are for my Pochette Matisse. Um, it, you buy, it comes with both of them. So it's, one's got a slip pocket and then the other one is just, uh, open for the front part of your bay. Um, I got a, another, um, this just holds lippies or whatever you wanted to have. These were a buck. So I got the little Samorga thing here. Then another purchase I made recently was this Chanel mirror. Everybody has it. I had to have it. So it just comes in here, the little beautiful pouch, and then you got the beautiful compact mirror here, opens up like that. So that's another new thing that I've gotten lately. Love this. Everyone seems to have it. I finally, I finally gave in and did it. I have another little silver one, round one I've been using in my purse forever that I love, but now I have my little Chanel bougie little mirror to have with my bags, which I love. And then the last little thing here I'll show you is, oh, I lied. Here's two other little Samorga totes here um, to put lipsticks and little bits and bobs in. Little purpley colored ones, I got them. I just thought they were cute. And again, I love color. Then my, oh, I love this. I wanted something in a brown box from Louis Vuitton, so this just checked all the boxes. I got my brown box. It's got like a little leather pull tab on there. Um, open it up. This was from Fashion File too, as were my two other bags. And I got this. It's like a little um, address book. It's got a chain here that you can attach to something else or to this and use it like as a wristlet. This actually would, you know, attach on here. Um, and then this opens up. And it's got slip pocket there, slip pocket here, slip pocket here. So the baton down there. And then it came with this. I love this. This has got like the gold lining on the paper. And it's the address book that came with it. Um, there's It's clean, no writing on it. So it came with that. The only thing it didn't come with is whatever little pen probably came with here originally. But I didn't care because I just wanted something in this print. Um, plus it has the brown box and, um, I will probably use that to put little, um, little items in that I want to keep in my purse, not necessarily an address book. Got that. And then the last thing I was going to do just for some more eye candy is bring out my Dior bag and, um, see how the Samorga organizer fits in it. So this is my newest only Dior bag. Oh, she's so pretty. I forget how pretty she is. Um, it's the Dior Carol. Put it up here. I gotta take the. I'm gonna use this right now. I'm gonna be switching into this bag, so I'll set this off to the side. So here she is, gorgeous. I did learn how to open and close her. Now I struggled with that the first time I showed you this. So here she is. I just have her stuffed right now. And then here's my Samorgan organizer. I'll shove her in there and see how she fits. And like a glove. So 
now I just have that in there again. The brown was nice because then you can't um, really see it. I mean, you can see it, but I mean, it doesn't stand out like it clashing. You still have access to the zipper spot back here. And then it's just got its little uh, spot in there. So yeah, that's my um, hero. I guess that I'm, I'm, whoop, I'm going into this now next for my fall bag. This is just beautiful for fall. It just is. Um, it's got a detachable, adjustable strap. And um, yeah, so those are just some things I wanted to show you. Just a little haul of some fun things I've gotten lately and um, am loving or can't wait to love on. Um, so uh, if you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and please uh, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Until next time, thanks for watching. Bye.